Okay, so I'm gonna tell you what's going on. This is my third attempt. Not off to such a good start. Just a second. This is my third attempt. I have recorded two other videos on this subject and truthfully I do not have the courage to release them. So I am asking the masters to speak this message in a way that is less triggering than the way it has been given in the previous two videos which you will never see. This message that we wish to speak is in regard to God is in all that I see. There are those of you who accept this when the image that you are looking upon is something that you deem good, that you deem joyous, that you deem righteous. When we put this same teaching into the context of something that you abhor, something that is so riddled with guilt, shame, fear, that you refuse to see it as it is. How can we say that God is in all that I see if what I am seeing is the abuse of children? Whether it be physical abuse, whether it be sexual abuse, For abuse is abuse, is it not? But in your mind, one type of abuse seems worse than another. Abuse of a child is worse than abuse of an adult. Sexual abuse is worse than physical abuse. You have this value system that has been taught to you. Is abuse not abuse? Some of the doctrines of the religious orders have taught that there are levels of sin, and this one we speak through now. Often, when she was following a Christian faith, was challenged by the idea that sin was sin that there were no levels to it, and it nagged at her and nagged at her. She understands this now, for we say there is no such thing as sin, per se. There is no good, there is no evil. This is something you have adopted and you have accepted and applied even, something that you have agreed to and participated in. How do you know that you have participated in it? Because you see one form of abuse as greater than or less than another. In fact, the very act of seeing abuse as different than any other experience proves this point. There are experiences not bad, not good, experiences. There are happenings, not bad, not good. They simply are. So we have given this teaching in two other videos, as she said. We understand her apprehension to make public those videos, for they are triggering, they are charged with emotion. And she was shaken, shaken 
by the material. Even though the teaching is no different than any other teaching that has come through, the teaching is the same. But your value system, your belief system, your structures of levels that are not in truth lead you to think one good, one bad, one less than, one better than. And this has caused complication in this teaching. For as we say, it is easy to say God is in all that I see when what I see looks good. It is easy to love those who are loving back. It is much more challenging to love them even when you must turn and walk away. And this is so. This is the teaching. God is in all that I see, for that is the truth. It is for you to find God in it. It is for you to seek God in all things. That is all for now. In peace and love, may you be blessed.